Hello, welcome back to Bellatro. We are trying to win Black Stake with the Abandoned Deck. I think, basically, in the first... Hang on, take the different flush. In... I think in the first... Ante, that's what that's called. Oh, that sucks. In the first ante, I think it's just best to play four of a kind. Uh, I think it's just best to play because you really need the money. Winning in two hands versus one kind of sucks. But I think it's all good. Runner is pretty good here if we can get going. Ace, two, three, you just need a four. Six, seven for this end. This is a little bit silly. This might be too ambitious, actually. I, no, I do need this ace. Two, three, two, three. Still need a four. Let's just play this pair, then. Ideally, I get to play more straights than this, but hitting this late means you kind of just have to take it as it is. Should be able to play two here, though. Ace, two, three, four. How many fives left? Two. Uh, Shouldn't win, right? Actually, this might win. Plus 30. Well, it's 30 chips no matter what. Yeah, I think it always wins. That's a shame. Also, we only make, well, we make the blind money at least, but don't make very much money off that hand either. What's the bloss? Bloss? What's the boss blind? Minus one hand size. That makes making straights very hard. I am going to buy this. Nice. I think... Don't, doesn't really matter which card it is. I think this is fine. I need to play two straights here, I think. Five, six. Wow, that was extremely lucky. But the more I play, the better my runner gets, so... Not necessarily a bad thing. Two, three, four... Five... For ace... Ace, two, three, four. So looking for ace and five. Four, five, six, seven. Three, four, five, six, seven would also do it. Any five is actually good here. Kind of down to play this, actually. No, that's got to be worse than discarding, right? We're trying to hit a five for either end of the straight. That's all we can hit, right? Because it's three, four, five, six, seven. Or ace two three four five. Uh, so I could just throw away two cards. Yeah, the score's not gonna matter. I don't think. Nice. Yeah, I don't think I'm, I don't think it's ever not scoring enough to win. So, just looking for a five there was correct. I think. I feel like it's so much brain power. Calculate straights properly, but. Oh, jeez. Alright. Well, this is good, but I can buy it later. Spare Trousers is pretty good. It's especially good now. Uh, I don't remember how big the next blinds are. I'm gonna just gamble and say I can do them. That might have been a mistake. I did not mean to click that. That was definitely a mistake. Well, if we get through this, we should be okay. If we don't... Uh, I deserve the punish, I guess. Uh, I should play the biggest straight. Six, nine. I should just play the biggest straight. We're gonna need, wow, we're gonna need a lot here. Uh, I think I'm throwing this away. Do I still have the ace of spades? I do. And the three. I think we're I need so many cards for this to work. Do I have the six of clubs? No. 
So I can only make the ace, two, three, four, five straight flush. So I think that's the plan. Not my best plan. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Not in love with this, but I think we have to play it. This should get make slightly more than the last one. And then the last straight should win. And we'll actually get maximum runner value. Wow, I think we lucked through this blind a lot. This foil joker better be good because I accidentally skipped for it, but we're pretty well set up here, but we kind of have to buy something that's good now. That is good in other decks. It's not good in ours. What's the boss blind? One in seven cards get drawn face down. That's not that big a deal. I think we have to pivot to half joker. I mean, it's actually not the worst combination. I forget that runner is... Runner isn't uh, straights get X chips, this scales. It's this scales from straights. Sorry. I think I might have a loose mic cable. It's been a bit uh, staticky. So apologies if the audio got a bit whack there. So now I'm torn between playing straights and, well, I'm going to play, I'll have to play three cards. Let's play this pair and see how much this is. It should be a decent amount. Oh wow, that just one shot the boss. All right, well, I would have played a straight if I had one, but I didn't. Seed money? Seed money's okay. Juggle is pretty good, but I don't think it's good enough through the whole game. To be worth it, I can buy seed money later. Definitely not skipping. These two aces should win. I think I do want to find straights though if I can. Two, three, four. I mean, this will win for sure. Ace, two, three, four, five, six. Two, three, five, six also works. I think this is worth it. I mean, that almost one shot. <laughs> okay, whatever. This little half joke is going to do a lot of work for a bit. Loyalty card's probably too good not to play. Yeah. Ruins my seed money a little bit, but I think we can surf. Five. Ace. <laughs> I was trying to find the straight. I think we can bank on this stuff for a while. I think I'm just going to play these and see how good it is. Because it's not going to be good forever. Four, five, six. Three hands remaining. Should probably want to play some hands for loyalty card. Seven gets me a straight. Depending on how much I want play my gold card there. Oh, that actually won. Never mind then. Was that a pair? I think I was supposed to play high card. I think two hands is maybe correct though. Four fingers. Fibonacci also seems really good. It's eternal, but feels kind of worth. I think it's kind of everything our deck wants to do. We seem pretty set up here. This doesn't let me skip, but it just makes him smaller. I want to keep the ace. Everything's kind of good here, actually. Might just play a hand. 
I know it's not good. Well, that was actually pretty good. Why was it so much better than I thought? Okay, I'm actually going to... Well, I guess I'm going to play it straight now because it's going to win. Right? I think that's right. Oh no, it's this malt that got me there. Well, this is fine then. Oh, well, never mind. That also won. So I didn't get to use loyalty cup, but I didn't need it. Blackboard. Paintbrush seems good. Can buy it later again. Oh yeah, Fibonacci too. We might end up selling half Joker at some point, but it is foil. Oh, this is gonna win. Should look for my eight then. Four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I should look for my uh my gold eight then. Six, seven, eight. Five, six, seven, eight. So, I think this just wins out, right, right. With this, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I am wrong, actually. Never mind. <laughs> Not wrong. Uh, 7 minus 13 is 5, right? 6. It's a number higher than 5. That's all that matters to me. Oh, sorry about that. My mic is having quite the day today. I don't think these just win on their own. So I think I can farm a little. Six, seven, eight, nine. I guess I could have played the ten instead, or as well. Oh, that did not do that much. Interesting. I do want to play hands for loyalty card. Is this my last? Yeah, it's a big blind. So I should play the max number of hands here. Probably keep these tens to try and play three of a kind. Yep. Just need a four. Get my tens. Doesn't really matter what I do here then. Guess to be safe, I'll play this. Oh, whatever. Um, I think it's fine. Calculating loyalty cut is weird, and I'm bad at it. <laughs> I'm gonna say next. Oh, can I play one hand type? I should probably just play three of a kind here then. I think it's the easiest way. For me to get through everything. 
It's not the easiest hand to hit, but I think it's easy enough. Oh, guess fours are better than twos? Yeah. Ace is left? One ace left. Have so many hits. Nice. Didn't have that many hits, but I felt like I had enough to justify. Now I just need a nine or an ace. I'm kind of in trouble if I miss. Could also hit eight in theory, but I think we're just never trying to hit eight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, easy peasy. Hit both. Play the one that's bigger. Did that not activate loyalty code? Oh, it was on the last hand. Oops. I guess it made the same amount of money then. Venus. Venus is kind of interesting. I feel like I'm still on the straight grind though. With this, this, and this. And I maybe want to replace Half Joker at some point. I guess I'll take this. Because it's cheap. And if it's good, it's really good. Straights are my most played poker hand. I could buy this. That's probably what I'm supposed to do. How much does this sell for? Two? I think that's enough, right? Yeah. Enough to get me back to 15. I'll buy banana. It's fine. Something like this. Looks good. Feel pretty set up here if I can find my straights. I feel like I need straight away, but then maybe I don't have enough. Um. And maybe I don't have enough other stuff. What am I trying to say? Enough malt, I think is what I'm trying to say. a lot of sevens should be trying to play this eight nine ten straight even if it means losing our gold eight how many fours do we have left one only have one four left. Two sixes. Just debating playing this full house, basically. Don't think I have that many straights left, yeah. Only sixes, two. Play five, six, seven, eight. I think we just play all of our duplicates then. And then hope to hit the last... Oh, that actually won. Never mind. The banana is safe. This banana actually is pretty important for right now. I am going to cash in the constellation. I think this scales much better. Now this will help our straight scaling. I think we're there. It's pretty close. Is the boss blind? It's fine. This is kind of tight, but I think as long as we hit planet cards, we're going to scale more than enough to win. Also, we won that last round without triggering loyalty card at all, and now we actually have a decent malt giver. Something like this. I was like, do we really not have a straight? <laughs> oh, we have two actually. Yeah, we're gonna need a little bit to scale this, but once we scale it, we're going to the moon. Also, banana needs to live <laughs> very badly actually. But we're getting a ton of runner scaling. 
Fernando doesn't live forever, but it does need to live for a little while. And yeah, I'm buying every satin and every celestial pack I see. And that should be enough to win. Yeah, the more satins we buy, the less reliant... Ah, oh, crap, I should have bought the earth. I forgot that I have constellation. Hang on. I think we have to use... A gold card there. It does upgrade runner, which is good. Oh, that actually might not have been better than a straight. I didn't even think about that. Six, seven. How many eights do I have left? Three. Sure. We just play this. Because playing the bigger straights is only better. That's four of a kind. I don't actually think this is that good. <laughs> that might have been really bad, but never mind. That was actually really good. <laughs> Amusing. I can't re-roll. Can't re-roll these for celestial packs, which kind of sucks. I think I need to buy this. I'm actually feeling kind of scared. <laughs> Strength is decent in a pinch. Oh, never mind. I think we just make a certain. I didn't think about that enough, which is actually pretty bad. I don't think the negative joke is worth it. We just want our runner scaling, I think. Uh, I didn't think about tarot packs also potentially being celestial packs, but I should have. Because they're also... They're also sometimes... What's that other thing? Oh, the thing that makes two planet cards. So, yeah, I should definitely just be... I mean, we're committed at this point, and I think it's enough to win if we hit... Ah, oh, the banana. It couldn't last forever. Need another joker, though. Sure. <laughs> definitely counts. It's about as good as the one we just sold, actually. Temperance seems... Fine. What's the boss blind? Diamonds or debuff? It's not really a problem. I still think we want to buy this though. Because I think having the option is good. Ooh. That's really nice. I'm going to be really tilted if this is Shako. That's really good if I can find a certain. Like, really good. So many duplicates. Yeah, I do want to play regular straights, not straight flushes. Oh, we're actually not getting there that cleanly right now. Oh, I should have played the three, maybe. Maybe not, though. Maybe, though. What the hell are these hands? <laughs> How many eights do I have left? Two? Oh, I'm actually dead, I think. No! This run was so sweet. Why am I dead? Hit an eight? Didn't even hit an eight. I hope this isn't up, but I don't think it is. Oh. I'm getting robbed, bro. So if that was a bigger straight, I would have won. I'm trying to think what happened there. I think selling popcorn was bad. Yeah, I think selling popcorn was just wrong. I got too juiced up by... 
by the lure of... Too juiced up by the lure of the legendary Joker. I don't actually think this is enough either. Oh, it's actually pretty massively under the threshold. Okay, well, lesson learned, I guess. I felt like, yeah, I think if I make better decisions, they were good. Ooh, I'm down. I'm super down. I don't know if it's good, but it's fun. Oh, this is, is this, does this count as two pair game? No, it does not. Well, it won the hand in one go, so it can't be that bad. I really want to buy this, but I literally can't afford it. Um, do I need scaling? <laughs> do I have to just buy the Celestial Pack and hope? Don't think so. I mean, I'm gonna play it. It does add them all after as well. I hope I have enough to win. <laughs> it's very weird that Oh, never mind. I was gonna say it's very weird that four of a kind isn't two pair, but whatever. I think in a lot of cases the game does apply that logic. Like if a, a hand is nested in a different hand, it will count, but. How much does this sell for? It's 10 malt flat. I think it's actually just good no matter what. It's not great, I'll be honest, but I think it's good. I will save my money. I think I'm actually pretty comfy for this ante with this setup. Trying to maximize the pants. So far, so good. I mean, getting us, we got this about as early as we, actually, we did get it as early as we possibly could. So, and it's eternal, so we're locked in. Uh, I think I'll take a random joker for three bucks. That's not bad. Seed money, I don't think is where we're going to be this round. Um, Making cards the same is good in this deck, right? I think I'll buy this. Random Joker? Seems good. Well, that's pretty good. Wow, that's really good, actually. <laughs> I was lucky. Sick. Oh, I didn't even check for nines. Should do that. Pair? Never playing regular pair, right? No, we just send it. This might be kind of tricky, but I think we're strong enough that it doesn't matter. Nine. Every nine we discard is a good time. Four, five. There's a nine. Think that was worth it? Nice. Now I think we need a bit more scaling, but we got a lot of money. I think this standard pack is better than the planet. I don't remember what the like chance of hitting. I don't remember what the chance of hitting like the certain planet you need is, but Ace. But I think it's not high enough to justify trying to spike whatever the two pair planet is. Because that's the only one we're interested in, right? And we don't have the telescope. Eternal regular Joker. That card is bad. <laughs> we do have money, so we can just be buying stuff. We have a lot of twos, which is good. 
Uh, six. I can discard this ace pretty comfortably. None of your sixes. I think winning. I think winning the round quickly is good. Mail and rebate at this point is like gonna get sold for something good better as soon as we can. I don't think we can reasonably make two pairs that are small enough to not trigger I'll buy this. Uh, to not trigger like to not win. So I don't think we can trigger spare trousers like a lot of times. That's why I'm not bothering trying to scale the pants because I don't think it's scalable really. Take the six, I guess. Maybe that six was bad. All well, hearts are debuffed. It's fine. Actually, this might be a good opportunity to do this. Ten. Tens make money if we discard them because this might not win. Nice. I mean, I guess I'll look for a 10. Does this count? Wow, it doesn't even count. <laughs> Whatever. This is still making a judgment, right? Yeah. I think that's probably what I want. Oh, that didn't win either. Oh, it did win. Why oh, did it go fiery? I guess it didn't one-shot. I think it only goes fiery if it one-shots. Does this work with two pair? I'm gonna say the answer is yes. Also gonna crack this. That is not good this run. I'll buy the duo. I assume this works. I'm gonna be very cranky if it doesn't work. But I can't imagine that it doesn't. I think we're set. Question mark? I guess we'll check to see if this works with two pair. Okay, it does. I think we're good. Just need to sell mail-in rebate for something better. Probably should have checked it to see if I had things to discard. Probably did. I will buy this pack. What planet am I looking for? Of course, Uranus. Um, I think I'd, I guess I could buy both. Use. Use. I think they're better to use than spend a dollar. Uh, didn't hit. Sure. Like high card slightly better. It's actually not bad at all. Two. Every discarded two. I'm playing the low pair just in case that doesn't win. Nope. Well, just barely one in my defense. Need a little bit more juice, but not a lot more juice. Don't think Eternal Showman is where it's at, or Eternal Juggler. We'll buy the Mega Pack again. Fishing for Uranus, nice. Oh, I have to click another one. Guess I'll click Mercury. Sometimes we'll play pairs, maybe. I think the gamble's worth the three bucks. Hey, paid off. Is it nine planets? How many hand types are there? No, there's way more than that. I think it's nine initially though. Sixes. What? I think this one shots. Oh, I should put that at the end. That was actually a pretty big mistake. Well, it was a minor mistake. Three sixes, three nines. So keep this stuff. Three nines, three sixes. Oh, I have to play a hand. That's no good. Well, I'm not playing one pair, so we'll just play this. That made some money, at least. I have one hand left? Okay, we're good. This is not... This needs to scale a bit more. Hand size? Paintbrush seems good. Paintbrush is actually absurdly good. I think I get more excited seeing uh, Grabber, plus one hand size, but... 
I think, I guess this contains pears sometimes. But possum hand size is very, very, very good. This is not that good in this deck. Even though we do need more malt, it might just be better than Malin Rebate, because Malin Rebate's kind of useless right now. I guess I'll buy this pack as well. Could also start re-rolling. No, it's actually so bad. I'm going to play one more round. Then I think we're going to have to... Because we have so many twos, is the thing I realized. I didn't even check this again, but whatever. Like, I have so many twos that... Basically not possible for make the twos better at least. I'd rather this polychrome two be malt than than uh, wild. Uh, stone cards are actually good. What do I want to make into stone cards though? I guess four. The lowest card in my hand. Yeah, I have a bunch of twos and one extra six. So four was fine to hit there. I sell this. Maybe we should be rolling for another joker. I will now roll for another joker. I wonder how good that is. I think I'm okay this ante, but I'm very worried about the next ante. Oh, this is good. Put this on the end, I think. If I could dupe this malted too. I mean, this is ante five of eight. Like we're getting up there. Time to melt on final hand of the round. That is kind of good. Guess I would take another trousers. Seems fine. Nothing seems amazing. Everything seems fine. Oh, that's what that means. That's trippy. <laughs> I don't think this is good, actually, but whatever. <laughs> it might have legitimately been better to buy. We're gonna be fine. It might have, final. It might have been better to buy. Um. What am I thinking of? Oh, Mr. Burns. Instead of keeping Sherman, because I don't even know what Joker would do here. I guess the duo. I think all my problems might be solved if I bought the duo. I want to buy this. Really? Maybe though. Might be the only way for me to scale more. Everything sucks. <laughs> That's good. I just like, I don't know what I'm doing with this Sherman. All right, we're gonna skip and just YOLO it, try and find a good rare joker. It's not my best plan, but it is our plan. Playing the lowest pair is still kind of appealing for scaling reasons. Guess I could get something else that scales with the uh, Peridolia as well. A very rich ancient joker, eternal ancient joker. Um, doesn't seem that good, which kind of sucks. Ooh, this death is nice. Left becomes right. It's not my super two, but it's a good enough two. Fibonacci maybe would be good. Oh, yeah. Death here seems good. Oh. Oh, that's arguably even better, actually. Buy this, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. I'm just, like, not 
confident in this run. <laughs> I mean, the trousers are going off. Bl Blueprint would win, right? I can find Blueprint. This is going to be... Yeah, that's enough. I need more things. Um, I think making this five two is good. We have a lot of twos, like probably too many twos, but whatever. Okay, we just need a bit more malt. I think either big malt or flat malt would be good. Is ramen good? This is good. I think ramen's good. It's not eternal. Yeah, that showman didn't do anything. <laughs> like struggling to think why I even had it, honestly. Like what was I trying to hit? I think I just didn't haven't really used it before and I was excited, but like even if I hit pants, it's not like it copies my current pants. Uh, I need to play cards here. Playing regular pair seems fine. I think I probably should have played more than two cards, but I'll play high card here. It actually isn't even that bad. This is good. This is what I wanted. I just want to upgrade the pants. Although the pants are kind of popping. Pants are not the problem. 135 on that hand. It was a half decent hand, I suppose. Not amazing, though. Go buy all this stuff. Buying that uh, cost reducer voucher at the very start of this run has proven to be very valuable. Oh, maybe I should use these in a different order. Make bonus twos, make bonus tens. I'm greedy, I'll just take the money. Start with zero discards. Well, joke's on you. I wasn't using them anyway. I don't know if this is enough. It's definitely enough to beat this ante. I don't need the money. Seltzer... Seltzer's pretty good. Has to be better than ramen, though. It's kind of hard to be better than ramen right now. Glass four? I don't, don't have any fours. That's a shame. I think I skip, actually. I'll buy this. There's maybe something better than ramen I could buy. Below 40 in your full deck. Oh, well. This is actually worse with the abandoned deck. Because the 52 card deck, it's every card under 4 gets you malt. This is every card under 40 because your deck's already so small. I don't think Juggler is good. Scholar would be okay, but... Is that better than ramen? So many chips. Okay, I'm gonna be honest with you. I actually don't think this is better than ramen. I think I might have just thrown the game away, but I'm too curious. <laughs> so I have to try. This is going to make so many chips. The malt might not be big enough, but... Ah, actually seems like kind of the same. So it's fine, I guess. It scales a little bit better, maybe, sometimes. I mean, it's kind of just all in on pants, as always, but... Is it so bad to be all in on pants? That's really good. I feel joker locked. I feel like I just need tarot cards. That's pretty good. Two copies of a selected card. I would like copies of this too. Oh, okay. I think now we're cooking. Guess I'll open this. Uh, Ace seems fine. This seems fine. Reroll seems good. Don't know what I'm rerolling for though. Planet cards, I guess. These aren't planet cards. Hey, 
Actually, I think both of these are good. And this still keeps me above the threshold. I hope we don't have to Mercury, but... Man, I wish I could reroll the boss blind, actually. Can use my discards again. Uh... Huh? Eh? Okay. So I kind of need a different card. You know what I mean? Oh, retriggering this polychrome is really good, too. Okay. That was pretty good. I think we're going to win anti-8. Just barely. I think we're absolutely doomed in endless, but that's okay. The point of these runs is definitely just to finish the stake. Pear is getting up there. How much worse is Pear than two Pear? It's actually better? Yeah, because this just gives Malt always. Huh. It's kind of fun. I think the Malt is better than the chips. We have so many chips. No, I don't care about that. That's kind of fun. Oh, I'm dumb, by the way. Uh, erosion does work the same way. I just forgot that I added so many cards to this deck. Whoops. <laughs> All right, ignore what I said before about Erosion. Erosion's exactly the same in this deck versus the other deck. Can I win? I think I can win if certain jokers get disabled. None of this stuff seems good. Whatever. I ah, think I can win? I don't know. Let's find out. I guess as long as pants don't get disabled, I can win. Actually, that might have been the wrong thing to say. Duo is pretty good. Although... Yeah... I really don't know what to think about <laughs> this run. I have a bunch of threes. Yeah... I think this is good? I don't know. We're like just barely gonna win or miss here. All right, looks like we're gonna win. In my pants! Oh, that's so savage. Is that just it? Just. Oh, is that it? Just losing the one in five. I mean, it was a one in five four times or whatever, and they dodged every other time. I think I'm actually just completely dead though. Unless, well, these are malt twos. I don't have any other like special cards. I just need the highest card. The tens and aces. I have eights. I mean, I should use these, right? Oh my God, is polychrome or malt better? I think I need the malt, I have no pants. Uh, guess discarding this is good. It's the same. I hope this is enough. It's so many chips, but it's not that much malt, but it's doubled. Oh, that's savage. Man, this game. Oh, Crimson Heart's a savage joker. If I had a reroll, I think I win 100% of the time, but couldn't find one. Um, I mean, if I don't hit pants, I think I win. I think, interestingly, Sock and Buskin was, like, about as good as Ramen. With the Peridol scary face interaction, so. I don't actually think that was a mistake, because I think Sock and Buskin arguably scaled better. I don't know, that was a weird run. I thought the pants were doing it for sure, but, oh well. Still not through black steak. I swear, this steak is giving me some trouble, but we'll get through it eventually. Very curious how many videos it'll take to get all the way to the end of the final difficulty. But I still believe in the abandoned deck, and I think we are learning slowly but surely. 
As always, uh, if you enjoyed the video, feel free to like, comment, and or subscribe. The choices are yours, but if you don't feel like doing that stuff, you don't have to either. And as always, thanks for hanging out. I'll see you next time.